Hey guys, it's Sam, and in this video, I've got an unboxing of the new MacBook Pro 13 inch with Retina display. Now, I was very excited to pick this up. I actually got it yesterday, but I didn't have time to record the audio until today. But anyway, I did pick it up at a local Best Buy. I'm super excited to unbox it, so let's go ahead and get started. So as always, Apple covers every box in a thin layer of plastic, so first let's go ahead and just cut that off. Now once we have removed that, you can just kind of tear it off. And then once we lift up the lid of the box, we can see the beautifully designed MacBook Pro with Retina display. Now this machine looks absolutely stunning. Yes, it does look like pretty much any MacBook Apple's ever created in the recent years. But if we go ahead and take a little closer look, you can just see how amazingly thin and sharp this guy looks. It looks absolutely stunning and amazing, as I've said before. And I actually wasn't aware how thin it was until I actually unboxed it myself. Taking a quick break from the device, in the box you get of course the Apple documentation, a power cord, and then an extension cord for that power cord. But if we go ahead and focus on the laptop once again, this computer boasts some pretty amazing specs. So the screen has an absolutely astonishing 2560 by 1600 resolution, which is greater than that of a 60 inch HD TV. That means all those pixels are so closely packed together that you get an astonishing 227 pixels per inch on a laptop screen. So everything looks absolutely crystal clear. No blurring of text or anything like that. Once again, you, you just have to see it to absolutely believe it and be amazed how clear the screen actually looks. Now internally, processing wise, we do have a 2.4 gigahertz dual core Intel i5 processor featuring a turbo boost up to 2.9 gigahertz and a shared three megabyte L3 cache. So that is standard on both the regular 13 inch and the extra $200 more 13 inch, the one that I did pick up. So if you are just going to get the one for $12.99, you will get that 2.4 gigahertz processor in that as well. Now in my model, I also do have 8 gigs of 1600 megahertz DDR3L onboard memory, which that's just 8 gigs of RAM if you didn't understand what I just said. And I've also got 256 gigs of flash storage in this, which may I mention flash storage is also upgraded from the previous Retina, that means the Retina from last year. It's going to be a lot faster on this year's model. Now this is 12.35 inches wide and only 0.71 inches tall, so that is very light, very short, and once again you really can't appreciate the thinness and how nice it actually looks until you see one in person. Now taking a look at some of the ports on the 13 inch MacBook Pro with Retina display, we do have none on the front or back, however on the left side we do have a MagSafe 2 power port, two Thunderbolt 2 ports, one USB 3, one headphone port, and then two, two dual microphones. Now on the other side of the device, we do have an SDXC card slot, an HDMI out port, and then a USB 3 port. Internally, we do have 802.11 AC Wi-Fi and Bluetooth 4.0, which is very exciting. I actually have the router that Apple did release at WWDC that features 802.11 AC Wi-Fi networking, so I have noticed a dramatic increase in internet speeds. Everything just loads almost instantaneous. Of course, I do have pretty fast internet for where I live, but I mean, this is definitely faster. I can notice a complete difference with 802.11 AC versus 802.11 N. And then also, Apple did ingeniously hide within the keyboard two stereo speakers, with may I add, sound really good. I've never actually listened to them before because I've just seen these in stores, but actually listening to them, my audio and music that I've listened to on them sounds really nice, and I was actually surprised at the quality from just laptop speakers. Now, don't get me wrong, they're not the best speakers you've ever heard, but they do sound quite nice for just laptop speakers. Now this new MacBook also features 9 hours of wireless web browsing and 9 hours of iTunes playback, which is absolutely amazing for a laptop with a retina display. I was thinking like 5 hours to 7 hours, but they somehow managed to pack a 9 hour battery inside this, which is just absolutely amazing. The battery life I've been experiencing is right on par with that, so you will definitely be amazed at how good the battery life on this thing is. Now finally, this computer does ship with OS X Mavericks, which is Apple's newest operating system for the Mac. I'm loving Mavericks, it's got so many new features, it ships with iPhoto, iMovie, GarageBand, Pages, Numbers, and Keynote, all those, they have great new redesigns, that's a whole nother video if you guys would be interested in that, but anyway guys, it ships with OS X Mavericks, and that's absolutely a great software, I definitely recommend upgrading to it if you haven't already. So guys, that pretty much wraps up my overview and unboxing of the new MacBook Pro 13 inch with Retina display. So if you guys did enjoy this video, I would greatly appreciate it if you did take the time to click that like button. And if you are interested in more content, make sure you do hit that subscribe button. 
Thanks a lot for taking the time to watch this video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.